Hey guys, 2.29 a.m. I want to read from our Missoula Spear Religious section. I want to read from the 24-hour day book, um, AA. <clears throat> and uh, hopefully this is going to make me tired so I can go to sleep. I'm all jazzed up, man. Well, I wish I could tell you why. Mm. <laughs> uh, I would bore you, but don't you fly. Um, not me. Anyway, February 11th, thought for the day. If we're going to stay sober, we've got to learn to want something else more than we want to drink. When we first came into AA, we couldn't imagine wanting anything else so much or so more than drinking. So we had to stop drinking on faith. On faith, someday we want something else more than drinking. After we've been in AA for a while, we learn that a sober life can really be enjoyed. We learn how nice it is to get along well with our family. How nice it is to do our work well, whether at home or outside. How nice it is to try to help others. The question is, have I found that when I keep sober, everything goes well for me? The meditation. Why do I do that? Meditation for the day. There is almost no work in life so hard as waiting. God, so true. And yet God wants me to wait. All motion is more easy than calm waiting. And yet I must wait until God shows me his will. So many people, so many people have marred their work and hindered the growth of their spiritual lives by too much activity. If I wait patiently, preparing myself always, I will be someday at the place where I would be. And much toil and activity could not have accomplished the journey so soon. Prayer for the day. I pray that I may wait patiently. I pray that I may trust God and keep preparing my life for better. 24 hour day. And how about Saturday, February 11th from the Daily Word, which I like so much because of the penguins. I like the penguins. The very pretty penguins. Oh, did you see my nipple? I just want to make sure you don't see that. I got a whole nother show going on there. Alright. Daily Word. Saturday, February 11th. Bumper is World Peace. The title is My Thoughts, Words, and Actions Contribute to Peace for All. What I desire for myself, I desire for all beings. There is only one presence and one power at work in the universe. As I align myself with this truth, I set in motion ripples of peace, harmony, and abundance throughout the world. In a quiet time of prayer, I center my thoughts on the perfect peace within me. There is no lack, no separation, only the wholeness of peace. I, for, I affirm aloud, I am peace, you are peace, we are peace. I rest for a moment, feeling my heart expand as peace radiates from me. I envision a world in which all beings live in harmony, free from lack, free from violence, and at peace. One by one, each of us creates this peace for all. And from Daniel 6.25, Then King Darius wrote to all peoples and nations of every language throughout the whole world. He said, May you have abundant prosperity. That's the daily word.